What's up, y'all, and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda. Hope you're having yourselves a stupendous day, and thanks for kicking it with me once more. We're still on the Nexus, so we're gonna close up on some of these side quests, and then we'll move on to the next one. All that equipment along. And the Tempest's readings are helping, but we've just scratched the surface. The history of the initiative cannot show that we were defeated by a space cloud. Some things are bigger than we are. I will not accept that excuse. This is science, and your merry band over there are scientists, aren't they? Figure it out. Goodbye, Director. Ryder, you're off to a promising start. I meant what I said. You are a symbol now of hope that things will get better. Though I worry about this terraforming network. What do we really know about it? It's like nothing we've ever seen. It's clear somebody had big plans for this cluster. But who? Not sure yet, but at least we're on the trail. Did you have some other business? Director, I checked out that murder. Nilkin didn't do it, but there's proof that he meant to. This is unfortunate. We're trying to give the people a sense of stability, leadership they think they can count on. And we're setting precedent for justice here in Andromeda. Now this, a convicted murderer who didn't commit the murder. He needs to at least stand trial. These things are almost never black and white. I know. If we suppress the evidence and uphold the conviction, we're banishing a man for a crime he technically didn't commit. If we throw the conviction out, we're freeing a man who tried to take matters into his own hands, then covered it up. Your investigation complicated this. You should take responsibility for the outcome. Do we still exile him for murder? Hmm. I don't know. Like, he should stand trial. Like... We shouldn't judge him immediately. It should be up to the people. But he didn't. It's still attempted murder, you know? He's too dangerous. He intended to kill the chief. He pulled the trigger, believed he'd done it. Banish him. Agreed. Sometimes we must rule with our hearts. I hope my conscience will be as clear as yours seems to be. Ah, at least we'll have this sordid business behind us. I had to. Maintenance crews, please report to the commons area. Let's see if he's uh if he's still there. Hello, Let's just uh spend the rest of our AVP points first. Thought we had more. Thirty one minutes. Spender, you have a job. If you want to keep it, do it. Hello again, Pathfinder. Uh how has the Nexus reacted to the foothold I've established? We send them where you signal, because that's where the need is. There's no time for preference. Director Addison? Pathfinder. I'm not sure if there are any more quests on the Nexus. Let's double check. Uh, Helios, Nexus, Firefighters. Okay. Anyone Speak with Dr. Who? Lower still? Oh, it's in a different section. Alright. Uh, Alright. I think we gotta go... We gotta go to Cryo, right? See our sister? Top, okay. 
No jump jets, so it can't jump. It is up here. Once we get we more biomaterial. Is that a scourge I'm wondering about? Then it's only going to But I hate to show you. Hello, Pathfinder. A moment? What can I do for you, Doctor? I have a math problem. Some vital equations that only a mind like Sam's could solve. They concern strange transmission patterns in the scourge. Perhaps random noise, perhaps not. Sam likes new experiences. It'll be an opportunity to encounter math homework. Given the complexity and the security implications, I recommend transferring the equations directly into Sam node. I have them on an optical storage disk for you. I'll see if I have time. Thank you, Pathfinder. Please thank Sam as well. Better not be no virus. Don't want, don't want that affecting us either. Alright, we gotta go to Sam Node and Cryo. Like Speedy Gonzalez up in here. Uh, habitation deck first, then we go to Cryo. Authorities continue work to establish contact with our Milky Way descendants. And then we'll try and head on to the next world. We're going to focus on trying getting the uh, remnant VI or VI remnant, however. It's you. What did I do? You, Pathfinder. I have a word or two for you. Is there a problem? Your father is my problem. He's everyone's problem. We're all paying for Alec Ryder's ego. He preyed on Jean Garson's trusting nature and bulldozed us to this godforsaken place. Now she's dead, and we'll all soon follow. You made that choice. This might be my dad's mess, but I will clean it up. Talk about ego. You're no different from him. You think you can do this all yourself. Go to hell, Pathfinder. All right, you rot on this station, then. Oh, I didn't force you come down here take the Milky Way hops back to the vortex what's the vortex all right anyway welcome back writer Dr. Arradana at the tech lab sent some equations for you to solve. I'm ready. Transferring them now. Have fun. Hey. Uh oh. What the? I knew it. Sam. Delicious code detected. Please stand by. Sam? Attempting to countermand malicious code. Please stand by. Is there anything I can do? Sam? Is that another malfunction or. Sam, you trying to show me something? Reset that panel. Reset this panel. Okay, I think I got it. Sam, talk to me! Hello, Pathfinder. Please initialize the console to restore normal operations. Sam, what happened? The equations contained a Trojan horse program, a virus. I knew specifically it! Specifically targeted to sever our connection and render me helpless. Reconnecting would be impossible. You'd need a crack AI programmer to create a virus like that. Yes. Only my unique adaptions prevented permanent damage. Unlock the door. Let's head to the tech lab and see what Dr. Aradana has to say. Hmm. How dare she? A bone to pick with her now? Back on to the Nexus. Species are at odds. This talks 
Well, technically, we're on the Nexus, but... Until demands are met. This is HNS. Hyperion is a separate ship. Alright, that lab was back here, right? This is kept the you! Are you sure the scan Get over here. I'm certain, Professor. She's like running away from us. Welcome, Pathfinder. Did Sam solve the equations I sent? Solve them? They almost brought down Sam Node. The equations contained a virus designed to target artificial intelligence. You think I... Never. I abhor violence against any life, organic or synthetic. Then how did the virus find its way into your equations? Perhaps my files were altered or replaced, but why? Hmm, I've seen a lot of down with AI sentiment lately. Graffiti, complaints to Tan, perhaps someone took the next step. Why would anyone hate artificial intelligence? Synthetic life has different needs and motivations. It can be mysterious and powerful. Many fear what is not understood. If graffiti is the best they can do, maybe they could use some artificial intelligence. Entire species were driven into exile by AI they created, champ. That leaves a mark. Attacking Sam is bold, though. I wonder if there have been similar incidents. The AI kiosk was busted this morning. I can look around. All right. Apparently they have nothing to do with it. So we got some detective work to do. Down below. Artificial detecting Pathfinder Rider. Hi there. Excuse the educational stuff. I hacked a Vena as a sock puppet. So, our virus set you free. Hope you're doing better without that AI jam in your head. Who am I talking to right now? A friend. Our movement sent the virus to save you. Pathfinder, it's possible they don't realize their virus failed. Pretending that it worked might win their trust. Hello? Ryder? Yes, I... I can't believe I'm free. Thank you. This is what our movement is for. Helping people like you. Knight says human AI merging is a threat to all life. She'd know, trust me. Oh, Knight's our founder. The virus wouldn't exist without her. I should thank Knight in person. I'll ask her. She might even give you a tour of our sanctuary. Great, thanks. Can't promise anything, but watch your email. Bye. Okay. A whole movement of AI-hating hackers with a leader called Knight. She and her followers seem to have experience with human AI partnership. If they attacked you, they're capable of anything. I'll check my email. We need to find them. Okay. Let's go, uh... See sis. It seems like there's still stuff to do in operations. Continue on various parts of the Nexus. Authorities have no word on completion and, and remind visitors to avoid affected areas. This is HNS. Oh, and we gotta. Oh, no, no. Harry, what's happening with Sarah? Well, we got her out of the pod. I don't want to get your hopes up, but Sam managed to, uh, find her, you might say. I don't follow. Well, she's still in a coma. But she also has an implant like yours, and Sam managed to access it. He's made contact. That's incredible. She's okay. Vitals are steady. But I'm letting Sam take the lead on this one. Though in a coma, Sarah's mental processes remain intact. So, is she okay? You can ask her yourself. 
A moment while I establish a link with her implant. Proceed. Sarah? Can you hear me? Is that you, little brother? What's happening? Where am I? There was a problem with your stasis pod. You're in a coma on the Hyperion. Do you understand? Uh, I think so. Am I dreaming? Sam linked into your implant, but they say you're stable. You're safe and sound in the med bay. This is so weird. I hear you, but I can't feel anything. Where's Dad? Is he doing okay? Oh, do I tell her the truth while she's in a coma? Ugh, she's gonna get mad at me if I don't say the truth. I don't know how to say this, but he's dead, Sarah. What? It was a freak accident. But it's Dad. He can't tie. He... I know. It's been hard on everyone. I didn't get to say goodbye. No one did. What about finding home? Dad kept telling me how beautiful it would be. Just wait till you see it. It's amazing. Even better than the hype. At least that's something. I should be there with you. Well, you were never one to quit, Sarah. A little nap won't hold you back. Right. At least Mom and Dad are back together. Somewhere. We will be, too. Right here. I hope so. I... What happened? The connection was only temporary. Her condition remained stable. Sorry, it seemed better than nothing. I'll keep you posted, promise. Thanks, Harry. I wanted to give her at least some hope. You know? Medic. Boy, Pathfinder, today has not been a good day. Why is that? A large shipment of medical supplies intended for Prodromus was intercepted by those damned exiles. Scouts confirmed they've divvied the supplies up among their own outposts. I'll see what I can do about reclaiming them. That would be great. Thanks. Maybe when you come across them assholes, you can rectify all this. Okay, more fetch quests. <laughs> All right, let's see what's in operations, and then we shall head. Wait. Oh, I guess that's it. Additional tasks. Back to Vortex. What's the Vortex? Oh, right. I guess that's what's still on the uh, Nexus. Meet Carrie. Petromos. Alright. Um... I think that's docking bay. Okay. Uh so how things go? I believe it's here. Did you find those? Never mind, don't answer that. I think they're straight from the Milky Way. Okay, now what? Welcome back. Yo, back. People happen when you work at a bar. <laughs> Got you there, Dutch. I'll have to get used to you too, I guess. <laughs> Fine. 
You can be a regular. What's your name? Ryder. I'm Dutch. That's Anan over there. Be careful. The snark is strong with that one. Snark is good. I can work with snark. Ugh. You're one of those. Looks like you're outnumbered, Dutch. You'd think people would reconsider picking on the guy making the drinks, but no. <laughs> Speaking of, want to try this one? I'm going to call it the Tall Moose. <laughs> Ryder doesn't look that much impressed. Alright. No experience for that? Just a little bit, huh? Okay. Let's, uh... Let's head back. Um... How do we dock? Over here? Watch your toe. There we go. Yep. Let's get on out of here. Welcome back. Oh, thank you. Okay. Um, email? Um, what is next? Priority Ops. On Aeon, on Aeon system? Okay. Uh, we do have... So there's Aya. We do have like a... A mission to go back to Patromos. Let's just see what's in these other galaxies. This is about as far as the Nexus surveyors could get before, well... Let's see what's waiting here. And I want to try to find the specific I'm picking planet. Up something. Deploying probe. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. Oh, and we got new armor, so we should probably uh put that on too. There's a specific planet I want to go to because... It's where we get the Remnant VI stuff. Kinda sucks that you don't get it until that, like... not panning out to be very profitable. Pfeiffer? Like Michelle Pfeiffer? Who names all these? Come on, Anomaly. No? Damn. 
place was a waste of time. We can go to a black hole. Isn't that dangerous? What a waste. Scourge. Ooh. That's the research vessel Dr. Aridonna informed us of. There are no life readings within. She'll want to know. 50 remnant research data. That's Habitat 7, where we were before. I wonder if you can land on it. Anomaly on sensors. Satellite detected. Milky Way research data. Anomaly detected. At least this place, uh, isn't so bad. Probes launched. We've got a crater. Experience. I'm picking up something. Deploying probe. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. Aluminum. Our last planet. I'll just, uh. We'll go to the new planet. Faster we do it, faster we get our, uh, VI remnant, even though this isn't where I want it to go. Sam, are you on? Collision is imminent. All stop now. Whoa. Cat ships, a dozen. No, more. They've got us pinned against the scourge. They are scanning us, Pathfinder. Well, scan them back! Where is the one who activated the remnant? Their DNA signature is there. Answer me. You're the one in my way. Who are you? They've lost navigation. We're being steered into their ship. Just tell me what you want. I won't explain what you can't understand. Ryder, I have almost regained control of the ship. I need a few more seconds. I actually know a lot about the Remnant. We should compare notes. Enough. Your defiance is naive and reckless. This day marks the beginning of your greatness. 
Sam? I have plotted a potential course through the Scourge. Do it! Report. Enemy destroyed. Damage to aft sensors. Scourge got it? Yes. Get us out of here. It will be tight. Hello? Hmm. Yes! Look at that stuff. <laughs> nice work, kid. Yeah. But who the hell was that guy? Ryder, we've got trouble down here. You need to find us a port now. Great. Where'd we end up anyway? Sensors are damaged, but I think we're at the vault's coordinates. You think? Gil, give it what you can. We're setting down. What planet is this? We're being contacted. We have to land. Open a comm. Tove, Jagalesto. Tove, Jagalesto. We're visitors from another galaxy. Our intentions are peaceful. Pav, Nalesetto. They've sent us a nap point. Set us down. Yes. Ha, look at that. It's beautiful. Kind of looks like Sir Kesh. We need in that vault. Please, you're not really going out there on your own. We can't afford a repeat of last time. I'm the Pathfinder. First contact is on me. Most important thing ever. <laughs> no pressure. If this goes badly, if I get eaten alive, even if it's hilarious, please destroy the vids. <laughs> Need me to take my shoes off? I am the ghost. Mason Roa. I appreciate the levity of this game. I'm Paran Shai, governor of Aya. We are the Angara. Hello. I'm a Pathfinder with the Initiative. Yes. You crossed Dark Space. I've heard of your journey. Joel, I have this in hand. Ephra saw this ship come in and sent me to find out what's going on. He's a human from another galaxy. A Pathfinder. Mm. Aya is hidden. Protected. What do you want? I apologize. Landing here the way we did, without warning, on fire, was not the plan. That's good to know. Because if it was, that would be a very bad plan. I'll inform Ephra. He'll be waiting for you in his office at the Resistance headquarters. I'll meet you there. I will accompany you through our city. Your crew will stay on your ship. Follow me. Looks like we're on our own. Follow closely. Do not try to explore the city or interact with anyone. Ephra's guards will use force if necessary. Understood. 
Is it okay to ask you questions? I suppose. If you're the governor, why do I need to see this Ephra? He's leader of the resistance. What's that? They fight the Ket and protect us. What's happening? We have a visitor. I didn't know, though. I detect unusual levels of electrostatic energy in the Angara. How did Milky Way people know that they were named Cat? I don't remember. It's just weird that... Am I that intimidating? You're an outsider who invaded our home. We know nothing about you. I'm not here to cause trouble. Then keep moving. It's weird how the Milky Way people call... Than the cat, How did it find just like the Angara does, without having communicated with one another. None of the local flora register in my data files. We've encountered an undiscovered ecosystem. Your city is beautiful. Thank you. You're the first outsider to see it. I'm honored. What happens if Afro doesn't like me? He won't. But you need to earn his trust. He's responsible for everyone's safety. I know what that's like. You're a leader. Trying to be. How long until the cat find us? This is the resistance headquarters. Afra is waiting inside. They are bullies, but this situation is now your fault. Don't get kicked out, Moran, not because of them. But you're telling me to be weak. No, I am telling you to be strong through your cunning and heart. Okay? Hey. It really is the best one in the Resistance. I know. Our experience with the Ket makes us naturally distrustful of all aliens. We've had our own run-ins with the Ket. Then you really do understand. When the Archon came to Helios, he demolished our sovereign state. Took what he wanted, as if we were nothing. Now, the Ket mercilessly abduct Angara. Often, we never see our people again. Come this way. Ephra is waiting. Wait, the cat kidnap you? Steal your people? And the Resistance fights them every day. With everything we can. Is it attrition? What are they after? You should save your questions for Ephra. Kadara be damned. I won't lose Vold. Ephra, this is one of the aliens from the Milky Way. A Pathfinder. Pathfinder. It's an aggressive move, coming to Aya. It wasn't meant that way. I have an arc full of desperate people counting on me to find them a home before they starve. Of course, I feel for you and your people. So, Pathfinder, never mind how you even found us, why are you here? On a hostile planet we call Eos, I explored an ancient structure, a vault, and brought it back online. It stabilized that planet's environment. Remnant. Recent intelligence supports that claim. If I'm right, there's a vault on Aya that's different. I need to look inside. You're right. There's a vault out there, but it was shut years ago and the entrance hidden. We... can't help you the most I could. She's our most revered scientist and elder. She knows this vault, but now the Ket have her, and our rescue attempts failed. She's lost to us, and you. Let me show you what I can do. I won't take one step without your approval. You have no idea what you're dealing with. The Angara learned years ago the perils of messing with vaults. 
So did the cat, for that matter. We're done here. Ephra. I feel... Ephra, what this alien says is extraordinary. The Moshai would want us to be brave and not let this chance pass. Joel, you talk too much. Let me assess this alien. I'll be your eyes. I know you can spare me. Go if you want. But when he tries to kill you, be prepared to strike first. I'm Jal Amadarav. I'll be your envoy through Angaran space. The Angar aren't my favorite alien design, but it's cool. Thank you for trusting me. I don't. But I can always kill you in your sleep. Good to know. I feel like they've got inspiration from the Togruta or Twilix from Star Wars. I've organized my analysis of Aya. Shall I relay it to the Nexus? Definitely. Be careful out there. You know I will. You really think the Moshai is alive? I'm sure of it. Don't kill yourself bringing her home. No promises. Alright, let's level up. I got six points. Um... Turret health. Then we're going with turret damage after. Now we got Jal with us. He's got energy energy drain and sticky grenade. Gotta be unlimited and resilience. Recharge speed. Shields restored. The recharge speed. Cool. Cora. You're at five, so put charge. Charge that needs combo primers. Uh, yeah, let's do that. And then Drac. These are the people I will only use. Vetra. She's got to level up a little bit. Okay. Stars above, it's you. I was hoping to get a chance to speak with you. You left your home to cross dark space. Is it true you can never go back? Yeah, this is home now. To take such a risk and give up your old life, mm -hmm. why did you do it? I couldn't resist the adventure of a lifetime. I know the feeling. There's a rush in taking a chance and hoping for the best. My turn for a question. Do I get to know your name? Oh, of course. I'm Avela Kajawa, curator for the Repository of History. We study relics of our past, try to piece together what we lost in the Scourge. And, the truth is, there was something I wanted to talk to you about. Pathfinder, how much do you know about our history? I still have a lot to learn. Centuries ago, the Scourge targeted my people. Our ships were the first to go dark. Many of those ships went down over Havaral. The wilds of that planet are filled with history. A scientist on Havaral just contacted me with the new nav point of an intact crash site. A huge opportunity. But with Remnant patrolling the area, we can't get close enough. Not like you can. How do you know about me and the Remnant? I have friends in the Resistance. They heard your conversation with Ephra. I know it's a lot to ask, but you have a ship and the means to get past the Remnant. Without your help, I'm stuck. You're trusting your history with an outsider? I know what people say about you, but I don't agree. I think you're here to help. I am. Now's your chance to prove it. You want to earn Aya's respect, right? 
Recovering our past will go a long way. I don't think Ephra would be too happy with this arrangement. Ephra doesn't have to know, and if he finds out, he can direct his anger at me. It takes guts to stand up to him. I'd face worse to get a piece of our history back. I've always wanted to give archaeology a try. Oh, I was hoping you'd say that. If you find anything, I'll be here. Thank you, Pathfinder. No problem. All right, let's head back. Rider. Your ship is... <laughs> we have nothing like it. Where do you see the inside? <laughs> it gets better. Oh, yeah. You ready to go? I'll introduce you to the rest of my crew. They didn't want us to explore, so... I'm sure we'll be back. I'm just saying, as far as first contact goes, at least that went better than the last one. Only slightly. Yeah, what happened? I wanted to look around. And now we have another mouth to feed, whatever he eats. <laughs> Did the translators not work? They work. Come on, everyone. Can we just all please try to... Just listen up. Begging. Interesting strategy. Ryder, we followed our best lead here, and now we don't even have that. Jal has offered to do what he can to help us access the Vault on Aya. How do we do that when we're leaving the planet it's on? That's... a fair point. Jal? Seriously? Settle down. Ryder's right. There's an Angara right here. Let's hear from the new guy. One day, about 80 years ago, the Archon and the Ket arrived in Helios, and the horror began. They declared war? Nothing so easy to define or fight. The Ket kidnap Angara. Their people disappear without a trace. What if they were us? Sure, I'll fight Ket all day long, but that's no plan. I agree. We need to get into that vault, Rider. Surprisingly, I'm with PB. Our own mission has to take priority. We have a plan. Kind of. Pretty solid. Jal? The resistance is stretched thin. I was tasked with traveling to two of our worlds at our briefing this morning. And you'll accompany me. Because? Because then, Ephra will see you as trustworthy. You want that. Jaws told me about these two worlds, Havarl and Vol. Before the Scourge disaster, Vold was a thriving planet of billions, a shining center of technology and life. And now? It's the center of our ground war against the Ket. Our resistance base is fighting Ket command for control of the planet. What about the other? Havarl? ...is the birthplace of the Angara. It's started to degrade, to become... ...wild and... ...dangerous. We suspect Remnant. Now we're talking! We've... ...recently lost contact... ...with our scientists. Still don't get how any of this helps us. I do. Help us, or rather help me, and I'll vouch for you, right? Because Jal wants inside Aya's vault, too. Pathfinder, it's your call. Okay. Yes. I appreciate the vote of confidence. Maybe more like optimism. Confidence? <laughs> You'll get there. Jal, give Kalo the nav points for both planets. Let's... do this. All right, we're going to Vold because that is where we get our VI remnant. Uh, 
still compiling my first impressions. But even their body language is so emotional. I can't wait for my first session with Jarl. Try not to scare him away, huh? Aya has Let's, so uh, much switch our mode out. Going with the Pathfinder helmets. Pathfinder armor. What's my uh, status right now? Two hundred fifty shields, five hundred health. Oh, we gotta switch that. Ooh, I, I kind of like this armor. Gotta charge my controller. Okay. Um. Yeah, that's good. Wait, no. We need to. Uh, Put our augmentation in. All right, let's get it. We are going to anomaly on sensors. Bed, moon. Probe away. All right. Tracking oh. a huge mineral deposit. We're gonna come back after I scan this. I can explore all that area some other time. Uh, we are going to go bold. Anomaly detected. Get this launched. up and then we'll land on bold. Tracking a huge mineral deposit. Gimme, gimme. Copper. Alright, let's land. Do we have to bring Jal? Okay, bundle up, people. I'll stay on my nice warm ship. Here we go. And then we'll take... Like, I want to bring these two, but I feel like we have to bring Jal. Uh, all right, let's go. Take her down, Callow. We designated this planet Habitat 6. Original readings suggest that it had a breathable, nitrogen-rich atmosphere and oceans of H2O. I take it that's no longer the case. All H2O on Habitat 6, vold to the Angari, is ice. And those oceans... Frozen over completely. Well, there goes the dream of a seaside property. That's a pretty intense blizzard. LZ is on the windward side of the mountain. Conditions are bad. I'm tracking gale force squalls.
Rough land. We're good. We're good. You sure? Want us to get out and push? Very funny, Ryder. <laughs> Cool. Oh, Suvi wasn't kidding about the cold. Oh, what the? Included. Blizzard provides cover. Great. It like glitched us. Keep going, Ryder. Try not to make any sudden movements. You're probably being watched. How many snipers do you think I got trained on me? Here, iridium. There's a heat lamp. Heaters straight on. Any squishies need to warm up? We're almost there. We'll need to talk to Commander Anyuk when we arrive. How'd y'all get over here? Extreme cold is detected, Pathfinder. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. Life support is stable. We're headed to see her now. Um, hold on. What are you trying to do? I'm reading a severe temperature drop. Keep on moving. I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Container here. Meditation crystals. Go. Good to see you again, Commander Dozil. And you, Jal. This is the alien. The one you think can help us. Yes. This is Ryder, of the Andromeda Initiative. I am Anyik Dozil. Remember the name, because if you betray us, I will kill you myself. Be assured that what I do to you will make the stars turn their faces and grow dark. Totally understood. Everyone wants the stars to keep shining, right? We're in agreement, then. If you wish to prove yourself, be an ally in our fight against the Ket. Despite our best efforts, their growing forces remain a threat to our people. Speak to our lookouts, who watch the valley. They'll know where our need is dire. Jarl, watch them, and be careful yourself, my friend. <clears throat> I always am. Alright, guys, I think that's it for this one. Thanks so much for watching and kicking it with me. Make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And then hit that notification bell so you can know when the next episode comes out. And until then, my friends, I will see y'all later. Have a great day. And peace out.